Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy Drip Kang, and you guys are probably watching this because you realize that NBA 2K has taken away the my career option for people who don't have internet. That's fucking crazy. Fuck 2K. Y'all worried this shit for that. But without uh, further ado, I'm gonna show y'all another way to play my career without internet connection. So stay tuned. Alright, you gotta let this bullshit load up because for some reason this happens. Anyway, so <clears throat> what you wanna do is go to my lead. You guys may know what I'm doing from here or you may not. Now, before we get into my lead, it's two different things you can do. Alright, you can either put a stack player that you built on a team. <clears throat> What's well, three things? You could take over a rookie. Uh, you could put a stack, uh, build your own player and put him on the team, or you can put your uh, your own player as a rookie and make him corny and build them up. It's so three different ways, but and it, and uh, and that's kind of the thing. If you want to do one of those ways, you gonna have to let me know. But I'm gonna show y'all how to do the way y'all most of y'all probably want to do. All right. So what you do is go to features. All right. Go to create roster. Don't worry, you don't have to create an actual roster. I mean. Go to create a player. <clears throat> don't worry, you don't got to create it. But you got to create a well, roster too. But all right, so click this. And I'm not going to really um, edit this. So all I'm going to do is just go down. But for you guys, actually choose your, you know, your abilities and what kind of shoes you want to wear. But I'm I'm just making this for the video. And I don't want to make the video long. So all I'm going to do is import a player at DNA. You guys can import player DNAs too if you guys want to. You know what I'm saying? Um, you can you can also like import their um appearance and all that too. It's kind of weird, you know what I'm saying. Um, but you can. So, like now he look like fucking Giannis. That's so weird. He look like Giannis, bro. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make him look like himself, but I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna give him the statistics of LeBron, but I'm gonna give him somebody like Oscar Robertson appearance. Alright, because Oscar Robertson retired, so it's cool. Okay, so again, guys, you can give him contracts and all that type of stuff. You can give him um, <clears throat> badges. Um, a lot of this stuff don't matter. Um, the contracts don't matter. The badges, again, do everything for your player. Give him sneakers. Um, give him his shoe brand, all that, okay? Then you click complete and click keep changes. So, boom. This is my player. Then again, name him his name. Don't name him Oscar Robertson. Name him whatever you want your my career player to be named, okay? This is just what I'm doing because this is I'm trying to make a quick video, all right? Now he's a 91 overall. So what you do is you go to create roster. You go to official 2K roster. Um all right, and now you go to <clears throat> my foot, my foot. This shit. All right, so now you go to um you go to uh you go over you press L1 like three times or something like that. I don't know. You just keep pressing L1 until you or um L what is it L B for Xbox to you get to your creative players up top. As you see up top it says creative players. If you look above the name Oscar it says creative players. And that's where all your creative players are gonna be. I click somebody like Oscar Robinson and I copy him to a team like the Philadelphia 76ers. Now, a lot of teams are going to be maxed out. So all you guys got to do is go over. So if that's the problem, go over to a team like the Philadelphia 76ers. Go over down to their worst player or the worst player in, in the position that you want to play. And all you can do is you can either release them to free agency. You can delete them from the roster. You can trade them. You can do whatever you want. I'm going to just release them to free agency. Cause I don't want him to just like die, cause that's kind of what a racing is. It's kind of killing him, and then I'ma just copy to team, and I'ma just put him on the 76ers, and that's it. All right, <clears throat> I say roster, and and then you do you just name it. So I'ma just do O, um, O O Rob for Oscar Robinson. All right, all right. Now after you do that. Make sure you click OK or yes, whatever I did for that just now. I ain't even read it, but I'm pretty sure you're supposed to press yes. So make sure you press yes. All right. Then after you do that, what you want to do is you want to go to Molly. When you go to Molly, you're going to want to go um, into 
my lead again because it's kind of where it is you got to press my lead twice basically but anyway um you go in here you click it now um this is kind of where it gets um important you have to press triangle when you get here i don't want you guys pressing current nba teams when you get to this screen press triangle when you press triangle this will come up then you want to go over to user created roster all right and then you will see the roster that you made oh rod that's the player think of it as players and not rosters all right so current roster you want you want the bottom to say whatever player you want so as you see mine say current roster oh rob so this is the player that looks like oscar robinson but plays like the greek freak remember how i made that player earlier that's that player all right so now i go to current nba teams i go to start in regular season um, you can set and now again. This is all personal preference. You guys can set this up any way you want if You guys want to play 12 minutes. I'm not really gonna get into this. This is all personal preference So I'm gonna just go ahead and press start on that and um, whatever team you put yourself on You're gonna want to take over so I put myself on the 76ers So I'm gonna select the team and I'm gonna click advance and I'm also gonna click advance again to get past this screen All right now um, Depending on how you like to play the game <clears throat> um depending on how you like to play the game um determines the sentence because you can control the whole team or you can just control one player if you want to i mean i mean not like that i mean like like you can make trades and all that if you want to or not so if you want to have like a gm responsibility and still control one player um you can but so next thing you do is you go to options you go to options and click possession a position sentence boom you click that you want to go to player lock not position lock player lock you want to press um r2 or l2 until you find your player that you made and again remember we made um oscar robinson uh oscar robinson look like that plays like um Giannis. all right there you go right here so what we're going to do is we're going to press him I mean, we're just going to lock them up. All you do is go to the player, and they should be fine. When you do that, that's the only player they allow you to play with. So when he goes out for substitutions, then you don't play. It simulates that, okay? So you guys do, you do, don't got to worry about playing the full game. You only play the minutes that he plays, okay? So don't worry about playing the full games. All right, guys? Um... I just want to make sure he gets some minutes before I start the video. I mean, if I start, so he's not getting no minutes. This is why I want to do this. So I'm just gonna code rebuild rotations. And how many minutes is he getting now? Shit, he in the starting lineup. All right. So now he's starting lineup. All right, cool. So what you want to do is that's pretty much it. Now, if you now now before we get into this, if you don't like all this these these rules and shit. What I want you guys to do is go over to Molly settings. I mean, not Molly settings. Molly automatics. And turn all this shit on um, auto. If you don't want to control the team, put all of this stuff on auto. When you put this on auto, you have no influence on trades, contracts, um, the draft, scouting. You know what I mean? But if you still want to control your team and be a player, then, you know, obviously keep it on. But if you don't want to, put that stuff on manual and, and don't worry about it. All right. After that, you want to, I'm going I'm, I'm to go ahead and play this game against the uh, Boston Celtics for you guys to show you how to, how it works. Because some people still won't understand. Um, so I'm going to show you how it works a little bit. It's pretty easy, guys. Definitely really easy to do this. Again, this is how you can play my career because they took they took it out the game. They took it out the game. So this way you can still upgrade your player um, and do all that type of stuff and still control only one player, even if you don't have internet connection. So that's why I wanted to kind of give it to you guys and um, you know you know you know what I mean give you guys a nice video because I know that's kind of fucked up what they did. You know what I mean? I, I play with online connection. So I don't have that problem, but for the people, I got over 160,000 views, 160,000 views. Like that's a lot, a lot of people who play the game like that. So, you know what I mean? That's kind of crazy that they did that, but 
You know what I mean? It is fuck. It's fuck 2K, man. You can't do nothing about it, man. They be on some weird shit. All right. So I'm going to try to get through all this. And um, as you can see, <clears throat> the circle is around Oscar Robinson. You know what I mean? As you can see. As you can see, I only control Oscar Robinson. I'm not controlling. Ben Simmons has the ball, but look at look how it's going to Oscar Robinson. All right. Also, if you want to make it super like my career, come over to camera and come over to um, where is that? My career default, and then um, you can zoom in if you want to. I mean, that's personal preference. Um, and then you just click save. I'm not going to click save. But you, if you want it, if you wanted to be on my career instead of 2K, click save. You know what I mean? And it's gonna be my career, uh, the my career camera. All right, you guys. As you guys can see, I'm only controlling my player. If I press X, it does nothing. All right. You only will control one player. Okay. I'm trying to tell people this, man. You will not control the whole team. Okay. You only going to control your player. As you can see, I'm controlling my player right now. As soon as I pass the ball. You know what I mean? I'm only I'm still controlling my player, alright? So I think that's enough proof. I'm not gonna play the whole game, obviously. I think you guys understand. So that's pretty much um all I got for you guys today, man. 2K did us dirty. But there's always a solution. So I came up with this, guys. Hopefully it helps a couple of the people who wanted to play it, but they couldn't. Um I hope I hope I really hope I help a couple guys out um, with this. Um yeah, stay tuned for more videos about offline stuff and even uh, like if you got if, uh, if you got online I do a couple of VC glitches throughout the year. So definitely stay tuned for VC glitches and uh, stuff like that um, I'm gonna have you guys in the next one. Make sure you like subscribe and comment definitely uh, leave a like um, if you don't subscribe definitely leave a like at least uh, If I help you guys out if it helped help drop uh, definitely try to leave a like um, I'm gonna have you guys in the next one again. Make sure you subscribe and comment um, You know what I mean things like that. Um, I'm gonna have you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace gang